Tonight on Documentify TV, the deep sea holds secrets. For centuries, it has swallowed ships, sailors, and the stories they carried. Most vanish, devoured by time, currents, and decay. This is the Black Sea. Hidden more than a mile below its surface lies a discovery that has stunned archaeologists and rewritten maritime history. Not just one shipwreck, but dozens. The Black Sea Maritime Archaeology Project, or Black Sea Map, set out to survey over 2,000 square kilometers of the seabed. What they found was an unprecedented collection, 65 shipwrecks spanning 2,500 years of history, from the 17th century Cossack raiding fleets to Roman trading vessels. This incredible fleet offers a unique timeline, allowing researchers to study the evolution of shipbuilding and seafaring across millennia. But one vessel stands out. Found off the coast of Bulgaria, this is a Greek trading ship, dated to approximately 2,400 years old. It sank around 400 BC, and it is believed to be the world's oldest intact shipwreck known to humankind. When researchers used remotely operated vehicles to explore, they could hardly believe their eyes. The ship was not just identifiable, but astonishingly preserved. Its rudder is intact. The rowing benches are still in place. Even elements of its cargo remain in the hold. Professor John Adams, the project's principal investigator, described seeing it as stepping back in time. He admitted he would have never believed possible finding a ship from the classical world intact in over two kilometers of water. This vessel's design was previously known only from ancient art, like depictions on Greek pottery, such as the famous Siren Vase. Finding a real-world example so perfectly preserved provides critical validation for these ancient artistic records. The secret to this remarkable preservation lies in the unique environment of the Black Sea's depths. Unlike most oceans, the Black Sea has distinct layers. Fresh water from rivers sits above denser, saltier water from the Mediterranean. These layers don't mix easily. Below a certain depth, roughly 200 meters, the water is virtually devoid of oxygen. This is an anoxic environment. In oxygenated water, organisms like bacteria and shipworms quickly consume and break down organic materials like wood. But without oxygen, these agents of decay cannot survive. The wood of the ship's hull, mast, and other structures is simply left untouched, locked in time. It acts as a natural time capsule. Recognizing the fragility and importance of these finds, the Black Sea map team has chosen not to raise the ship. It remains safely on the seabed, where its environment provides the best long-term preservation. Advanced robotics and digital mapping are used to study the wreck without physical disturbance. Determining the exact age of ancient vessels requires careful scientific analysis, including carbon dating. While techniques have advanced, precisely dating ships from certain historical periods can present challenges requiring refined methods and calibration curves to ensure accuracy. But the dating confirms the ancient origin of these remarkable vessels. The sheer number and condition of shipwrecks in the Black Sea fundamentally change our understanding of ancient maritime life, technology, and trade. This dark, deep water is not an empty void, but a vast, silent archive. So much of the seafloor around the world has not been mapped and explored. We can only imagine what else is down there. That's it for today's video, folks. See you next time, right here on Documentify TV.